What's up guys, this is Alex of Baseball Cards AF, back with my favorite product of the year on release day, Gypsy Queen 2019. This is going to uh, break down to 24 packs per box, 8 cards per pack, 2 on-card autographs per box. We've got Otani on the front, um, nice looking box as always, here's kind of the, the, uh, the odds in the back over here, if you guys can see that. So, anyway, without further ado, um, let's roll the intro, and uh, we'll just break right into this. Give you a little quick breakdown. There's going to be 300 cards in this base set. Uh, 301 to 320 are going to be high number short prints that I believe come one to a box for hobby. Um, there's going to be 20 uh, fortune teller minis, and there's going to be 22 uh, Tarot of the Diamonds inserts. So like last year, I am going to be attempting to do a master set with this starting it for me, and then I will be doing networking to fill the rest of that set. So with that being said, if you guys have any cards that I'm missing, please drop me a line, help me out. Um, I'm trying to get this set as cheap as possible, but I always start with a hobby box. Um, just to get it kicked off. So without further ado, let's just break right into this bad boy and see what we've got going on. I am so excited. This is my favorite product every year, um, and it's kind of what started my obsession back into collecting full time. Um, if I can even get this cellophane wrapper off without stabbing my finger, we're good there. All right, so there we go, and here's the seal right over cheer. All right, so instead of box toppers this year, they're going with more of a uh, um, exclusive three chrome cards in a pack. So um, just to start this off, we're going to open this up first. So really clean looking um, topper pack. Um, love the logo, just love everything about this product. So let's just see what we can do here. And first up, we've got Brandon Crawford, really nice chrome Gypsy Queen card there. We've got Edwin Encarcion, and someone I always pull, Luis Severino, it seems like. So these are going to be the chrome um, topper cards, I guess is what they're calling them this year. Um, there's 100 in this set, um, and that's what they look like there. Here's what the backs look like on those. I don't know if that's what the uh, the back of the base cards look like or not, but you know, we'll we'll set those to the side over here and uh, just kind of break straight into the box. So, um, best way I'm going to do this is going to be sliding this over here, so we still get my logos over there, and we're just kind of gonna work our way into this box. How's everyone doing? How's uh, the card collecting um, hobby treating everyone? Uh, like and subscribe if you haven't already, especially if you like products, uh, product reviews, box breaks, uh, pack rips, that sort of thing. And uh, let's just start off. Start off right here. We got a uh, we got Jalen Becks. Clean looking cards right off the rip. Let's see. Do, do, do. Next we've got Chris Davis. DH. So we've got the team logo on the left, position on the right, Gypsy Queen in the middle. Very symmetric looking this year. Um, we've got 2019 up in the corners, tops in the middle. Um, then we've got uh, baseball picture cards uh, on either side of the Gypsy Queen logo, as well as the, um, the uh, player name. So anyway, uh, not to state the obvious, just uh, stuff that I like to point out. I love the design of the cards, um, and I love interpreting them as such. So anyway, we've got Dylan Bundy next. We've got Wade Davis. We've got Roberto Clemente. We got our high number already. Um, high number short print Roberto Clemente. Flip this over. And that's going to be number 307 up in the top corner, if you guys can see that there, so of a 320. So um, there's my short print. Um, not a bad name to start off for my uh, short print high number collection there. So 
Um, we'll be flipping that right over here and take a look at what else we've got going on. We got uh, Mondesai um, for the Royals. Heard he's going to be a player this year. Uh, we've got Steven Duggar and we've got Jose Altuve. All right, just kind of going top left to right and uh, so on. So um, side profile there. We've got Corey Kluber. We got uh, Yolmer Sanchez. We've got Tommy Pham. Very nice there. We've got D Gordon. We've got Salvador Perez. Tyler Mabel and. James McCann, as well as Josh Rogers, rookie. Um, so you guys can kind of see up in the corner there that rookie insignia is kind of just blends in with the design of the card. So they're going to be a little harder to, to track. I may have even missed some. So we'll do rookie. Looks good there. Rookie, yep. Steven Duggar. And uh, Mr. Beck's Beaks, Mr. Beaks. So yeah, uh, missed a couple rookies already due to that insignia just blending in um, to the design. So, but nice little incognito there. We've got uh, Brad Keller. We've got Robinson Cano. We've got Kyle Schwarber. We've got Seth Lugo. We've got Reese Hoskins taking a bow. I don't know if that is a, uh, I don't know if that's a variation or if that's actually his card. Um, I'll have to do a little bit of research on that. So um, I'll just set that one to the side here. And we've got a blue parallel for Trevor Richards, rookie. Flip that over, and that is going to be numbered to 250. So. Nice little thing there. I'm going to set all those ones that I think might be something over here in that middle section over there. We got Johnny Cueto and then Freddie Freeman. Off to a pretty solid start. Love the way these look. Very nice and clean. I like the borders on them this year. Um, the cardstock is phenomenal, um, just like Ginter and Gypsy Queen in the past. We got Hunter Dozier for the Royals. We got uh, JT Riddle. We got Walker Bueller, one of my favorite baseball names of all time. We've got Luis Castillo. We've got Ahmed Rosario, another one of my favorite rookies from last year. We've got Shohei Otani. So here's the Otani. This is what that one's going to be looking like. And uh, yeah. So uh, they show the pitcher and DH on the bottom there instead of just one or the other, which is pretty cool. Um, we got uh, D.D. Gregorius and Willie Adams. <laughs> Off to a solid start. Are you guys going to be opening up any of this product? What's your favorite product you've got rolling for you guys? I know a lot of people are holding out, waiting for that uh, Bowman um, to come out, Bowman Draft, and uh, a lot of people are into the shiny cards, you know, like Chrome and Prism. We got Felix Hernandez. We've got Noah Syndergaard, no Cardinals yet though. We've got uh, Jake Gabe, rookie. We've got Sean Segura, not to be confused with Tom Segura. We've got Chris Davis, not to be confused with Chris Davis. Uh, we've got Rowdy Tellez, maybe. We've got Justin Turner. And we've got Robinson uh, something or another. My apologies on butchering that name. I'm trying my best, guys. I'm really trying here. Kind of an old school meets new school this card product is, and that's why I like it. And it looks like we've got our first fortune teller spaced right here, if you can see that. So I wonder what one that is going to be. And that is going to be J.D. Martinez. Really clean looking fortune teller. Man, that's a nice, that's a nice card. Gaze into the future. Love the border. The symmetry on it is nice. Here's what the back looks like. Sweet. Yep, I'm okay with it. I'm okay with it. All right. We might have to do this in two parts because I am uh, 10 minutes in 
nine minutes in, and we're not even halfway through. So we got uh, Julio, we got Chris Archer, we got uh, Chris Shaw, rookie, we've got David Price, we've got uh, Valdez, rookie, we've got Corey Dickerson, and we've got Cody Ballinger. Side profile, no minis that time. We got Busta Posey. We got Mitch Hanniger. Got David Peralta. Tyler Skaggs. We've got Austin Meadows. Heath uh, Filmeyer. Got Antonio something or another. And Felipe Vasquez. So I'm hoping to get maybe like a Jeter, a Trout. That'd be kind of cool for one of the autos, huh? We got Alex Cobb. We've got Patrick Gorbin. We've got Elvis Andrus. We've got Kevin Kermeyer. We've got Francisco Mejia. Woo! Okay. Here's our first hit. Dylan Cozens for the Phillies. Nice little signature there. On card auto. Here's the back. Very nice. That's what the back of the autos look like. Clean. Front. On card. There we go. I'll take it. Put that over here. With this. And we'll flip this back around. Oh yeah. Let's set that there. And that there. Alright. One auto down. One to go. We got Lorenzo Kane And then Okunia. We got us an Acuna. Really clean looking card there. Alright. First auto down. One fortune teller down. No fortune teller in this one. We've got uh, Eduardo Escobar. we got uh, Robles, Mr. Victor. We've got Jose Martinez, my first cardinal of this set. Nice clean looking batting stance there. We've got Edwin Diaz, uh, Jose, something or another. No name. Missing nameplate here of Chris Archer. Missing no plate. Uh, missing nameplate. Chris Archer. If you guys can take a look and see there. Missing nameplate. Throw that over in the middle section there. We got David Dahl next, and Andre Delton. Uh, Andrelton. Goodness gracious. Mr. Simmons, I need to stop trying to pronounce his name. My apologies. My apologies. We got us another, got another uh, fortune teller. Let's see. And this time it's going to be Mr. B. Snell. Mr. Blake Snell. If I remember correctly, he was the Cy Young winner. Another clean looking fortune teller there. Nice. We got Yon Moncada. We've got Trey Turner. Ryan, uh, Ryan something or another. My apologies on that. Rookie. We've got uh, Danny Jensen. Rookie. We've got uh, Corey. Uh, Spangenberg, hmm, interesting name there, Kenley Jensen, and Kevin Newman. That was a horrible rip on that pack. Goodness gracious me. Haven't gotten any Taros yet, but those are a little harder to come by. Can't wait to see one of them though. Hopefully I'm able to land one of them. We've got a, uh, yep, Garrett Cole, Anthony Rizzo. Ooh, we got a black and white variation over here next coming up. We got Scooter Jeanette. We've got Sin Chu Chu. And who's going to be our Miguel Andahar? Clean, clean looking Yankees black and white variation. Look at that, guys. With that blue popping. Yep, I'll take that. Numbered to 50. Heck yeah. 
We'll take that for sure. I love that. Love those black and white cards of any set, especially Gypsy Queen. We got Mark Trumbo and Justin Smoke. The Smoke Show has shown up. Tear this one off camera so I don't embarrass myself again. We got Rick Porcello. We've got uh, Ken Giles. We got Michael Kopeck, rookie. You Darvish. Justin Sheffield, rookie. Max Scherzer, the Mad Max, has shown up. We got Miguel Andahar and. There's the difference. Can you spot the difference? I'm colorblind and I even can. <laughs> Pretty cool. Pretty cool. We got Mookie Betts showing up. We got a uh, Jose uh, Urena. Jose Ramirez, Mikhail Franco, Clayton Kershaw, and looks like we've got our first tarot coming up, so I'm excited for that. Uh, Francisco Arcia, and who's going to be our first tarot? <whistles> yup. Of course, it has. It had to be him, the magician, Clayton Kershaw. God, I love these. There's what the back looks like. Number nine there. Clean looking backs. Love the, the geometry patterns on it. Um, the rounded edges. Just clean all around, really. I'm okay with it. I'm okay with it. We'll set that over here. And hopefully I can get another one or two of those. We got uh, Duel Lugo. And we got Zach Cozart. That was a rookie. I missed my apologies there. And I'm peeking. It looks like I've got another tarot. So let's... Oh, Stephen Piscotti up on this one. I'm okay with that. We got Matt Chapman. We've got Ian Happ, the Happinator. What's happening? Jason Hayward... The world, Shohei Otani. So the first two that I've got from these tarot cards, I'd say some pretty solid PC players for me. Love this one as well. Clean looking card. And there's what the back looks like. That's uh, tarot number one. Tarot of the diamonds, T-O-T-D. Number one and number nine is what I've got so far. Slip that over there as well. Then we've got Will Myers, Gregory Polanco, and Jonathan Villar waiting for that other autograph. Checking for other rookies real quick, just for funsies, because I'm blind as a bat, and uh, I can't I can't see a lot of the time. I did. Oh, yep. There's a rookie there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't know why, but every once in a while I'll just hum O oh, Canada and it really throws people off. Throws me off, for sure. But I'll be doing a condensed version of this as well, kind of showing off my um, hits and whatnot. Um, we got Yachty, ooh, in this dirty little blue outfit here with the uniform blue uh, and gray road. I like it. I like it with his uh, Nike get up this time switched over to uh jordan a couple maybe last season something like that anyway mike trout we've gone fishing and we found him we've got andrew benatendi what a solid pack this has been we got yachty trout benny and the jets blake snell okay so cy young we got trevor bauer okay oh we got another <laughs> tarot with the diamonds this time we got Jesus Aguilar, King of Wands. King of Wands there. Flip that over. See what number that is. 21. 21 of 22 for the 
um, Tarot of the Diamonds. Next up, we've got Christian Stewart and then Chase Adams. So, Chance Adams. So five solid cards with the Tarot, Blake Snell, Benny, Molina, and Trout. I dig it. And we're getting down to our last six packs. Thank you if you guys have watched this whole thing and enjoyed it. Drop me a line below what um, my favorite or your favorite card that I've pulled so far is. And, uh, you know, just keep rolling along. We got Kyle Freeland. We got Billy McKinney. Uh, Mr. Tanaka. We've got Adam Eaton. We've got No Name. We've got another No Name Missing Nameplate Parallel. And that is going to be of Eduardo Escobar. So Eduardo Escobar. This time, no number. We've got uh, Josh Reddick. Uh, Jeff McNeil and Xander Bogarts. I'm thinking about going by Xander instead of Alex. Uh, my brother and my wife have told me uh, I should not do that, so I probably won't. But anyway, let's keep on rolling and hope that we get something tasty. And uh, looks like we might have another fortune teller, so let's just slide that puppy out. We do. And this time, all rise. We've found the Judge Teller. Clean looking card as well. There's what his back looks like. Fortune Teller, AJ. Got three fortunes, three tarots, and a couple more packs to go. Daniel Pol uh, Polka. You like Polka music? We got Ryan Braun. Brian Anderson, Manny Machado, we got uh, Mr. Blake Triner, mm. Kyle Seeger, and uh, Abisail Garcia. Four packs to go. Side prof, no, no indication. Joe Panic. Don't don't panic. I'll be doing more videos soon, guys. We've got Alex Gordon. Mr. Gordo. Probably going to retire this year, if I had to guess. We've got, uh... Wow. What a, what a full name that is. Matt Davidson. Uh, Jameson Talion. Paul DeYoung. Second Cardinal. Third Cardinal. Third Cardinal that I've been able to pull out of an entire box. We've got Roughned Odor and Carlos Rondon. Check and make sure I didn't miss any rookies again, because, you know, I do always. Oh, they were, man, these are packed in there so tightly. I thought we were close to the end, and we still have quite a few more. Goodness gracious. So, um... If you've stuck with me this far, you might as well just make it through the end here and see what else I pull. Um, we've got uh, Ryan O'Hearn, rookie. We got uh, I don't like the way that card looks. We've got Nomar Mazzara, Addison Reed. We got James Paxton, Johnny Cueto, Gypsy Girl. Fo uh, a logo variation, so logo swap there. If you guys can see that, um, I believe those aren't numbered. Yeah, that's just a just one of those things. So then we got uh, Scott Kingry and Taylor Ward, rookie. Side profile again. We might have our auto. Nope. We've got Adam Gimber, Jacob DeGrom, Aaron Nala, Ronald Guzman, Sean Manea, Brandon Crawford, Travis Shaw, and Jake Bowers. Now this this feels promising. This one feels like a nice, 
no indication, but it, it felt a little different. So we'll we'll see. Chris Bryant, uh, Rasiel Iglesias, Marcus Stroman, Miles Michaelis, dirty dirty stirrups he's got on. We've got uh, Joey uh, Lucchesi, Giancarlo Stanton, uh, Nico Goodrum, Michael Comparto, and Starling Castro. And looks like we're going to have our other fortune teller here. So our other fortune teller is going to be Jose Altuve. How perfect. Uh, that's actually his proper height. Um, they were able to shrink him down onto a mini card because he's so short. It's <clears throat> a little joke. Yuli Gurriel. Uh, Jorge Polanco. Glaber Torres. Everything's good in the Glaber hood. We got Alex Bregman. Nice little action shot there. We got Tanner uh, Rourke, Zach Wheeler, and Javier Baez. Two packs left. Eight trading cards left in these packs. And let's just see what we have going on. We got Rafael Devers, Dansby Swanson, Yan Gomez, Brandon Woodruff, Marcelo Zuna, Mr. Big Bear himself, awesome uh, navy blue um, road uniform there. I like that they're using those for a lot of the Cardinals from what I've seen. We've got uh, Nick Williams, got Max Kepler, and a rookie, Kyle Wright. So, if all goes to plan here, this last pack should have one other hit. Should have an autograph. And uh, I hope I don't get stiffed. So, we'll, uh, let, me, let me do a, a quick, quick little peek -see, And uh, I'll just bring these to the front. We got Joey Gallo. We got John Gray, Orlando Arcia, Witt Merrifield, my boy Witt. We got Trevor Richards, Brandon Nemo, Jackie Bradley Jr., JBJ, and last but not least, we have first baseman Matt Olson. Nice little signature on that A's. Mr. First Baseman Man himself of Gypsy Queen Baseball, Matt Olson. So there's our other autograph, guys. Not too bad. Not too great, but this one is numbered to 99. So we got a little bit of number in there. And uh, so here's here's the difference, I guess. Let me see what uh, what exactly is different about the parallels. Um... Here's the base autograph. This one is, oh, okay. So we've got the logo swap. So this is the Matt Olson Gypsy Girl logo swap numbered to 99 in comparison with uh, Dylan Cozens. So there we, go. there we go, guys. Uh, you survived all 28 minutes of this. Um, I will be doing a recap video, just kind of showing off, giving my initial thoughts and whatnot. And I'll let you guys know what cards I'm missing from this huge 300 card set and just to show you guys um, what type of dent we've got so far here's going to be our rookie pile right over here and then here's going to be the rest of our base a little bit more base boom and then last but not least just a little more base for us so we've got base base and base we've got four fortune tellers um, of 15, we've got three of the Tarot of the Diamonds out of 22. We got two hits, the autographs here. And uh, 
just a handful of really cool variations, numbers, and all that fun stuff. So, um, nice little, nice little break. Really love this product. Thank you so much for tolerating my rambling. Um, like and subscribe if you haven't already, and you guys know the routine. If you've been here for any more than one video, as always, till next time. See you.